February 2019, I had a vision of creating a chicken house with a chicken run that led to a compost area for chickens to turn the compost. This was to be in my sanity garden. It didn't work out. And this is their shed for now. I'm going to, I'm hoping that the, the other chicks that I have will have some hens in here for this guy right here because he needs more women. And then she's laying the eggs in here. But I give them some extra food. Sorry. Since they're locked up in this smaller section and there may not be enough bugs. But aren't they pretty? Okay. Let them eat before I close them up. And then I have this container of water that I just get their water from. And then they come back through here, down their little alleyway. Fast forward to 2024, I found a new purpose for the chicken coop area. But I need to move this tank. This is a 2,500 gallon tank, water tank, and I want to move it over to where the gray posts are and create a top where when it rains, the water catches the rain and it falls in there. Because I really don't want it at the corner of my house. I call it my house. I want to live there. Um, but I have to move it around here and I want to put the water tank right here so that it's out of the way. It's got its own space. I can create a drainage uh, catch water catching system here so that I can water plants or use it in my shed. And then I will probably have to pull up all these T-posts in order to get the tank over here. So I gotta clean all this up. Okay, so while we, uh, today we also went into town to take care of some errands and I picked up some pea gravel. I wanted to get 20 bags. I may not need 20 bags. If I need more, I got 10, but if I need more, um, then I'll go get some more. But tomorrow I'm going to Pour the pea gravel in, and I'll have to put something over here to help hold the gravel in. It's deeper here than it is over here, so some of that gravel is going to come out over here. What I plan on doing afterwards is getting some concrete or some quickcrete and putting the concrete all the way around over here to help hold it in, hold the pea gravel in, like I have the bricks as a border. On the on the other sides so that's that's the plan for tomorrow and then after this is level leveled out and the bricks are back on the square bricks then will roll the tank around and put it in today today's the 20th of February and my husband and I just took our time to tilt the tank over and drain the water out of it the water is from condensation so once it's it's done tomorrow we're going to finish putting pebbles down around or i'm going to around the trench square trench that i dug out um, and then we will roll the tank up this way and around the drive and to our spot over here Doug's not looking forward to it. He has um, degenerative disc disease, so just tipping this tank over caused him a lot of pain, and he's laying down now because he's hurting. And I really appreciate his help, but that's why he's, he doesn't do a whole lot anymore on the property because um, of his back. <laughs>
leveled 10 blocks on the pea gravel and I have 10 more to go so I'm gonna have to get 10 more bags of pea gravel from Walmart and then I'll be done unless I have to clear out the middle the middle section um, if it's if it needs lowered This is Monday the 26th of February and it took 34 no 32 bags of pea gravel to level the blocks and get the middle level I have some boards to roll the um, black water tank up on and hopefully we can get it set up straight so we can push it in we'll see how that goes Well, I got her moved. I rolled her up a little hill underneath that tree and swung it around. And then Doug helped me get it in position and then we lifted it. It wasn't hard to uh, roll. Um, I had to use the top of the tank to grip to turn it the direction I wanted it to roll. But it wasn't that hard. Anyways, I didn't film it. I wished I had. Now, I wished I had. But I brought it right through this pile here. Brought it through and then maneuvered it underneath this tree limb. I didn't take it down the road because I didn't want all the gravel scratching up the tank. And I didn't want to go through this mess. But anyways, I do have a mess to clean up. But it's done. She's in. Right where I want her. Hey kid, don't ever let them get inside your head They'll tell you what to do in life instead Of everything you know that you could get
Let them guide your life towards regret. I'll fight for what I love with every breath.